101k grocery haul okay yeah we having a, a taco movie night or whatever and i just wanted to show y'all everything we got we also got some basics left you know just for our house or whatever but here we got some bacon some cinnamon raisin bagels for me because nate does not like those we got some uh what does it say? Smooth multi-grain bread. Some hot and spicy chips. Um, what else we get? Oh, we got some lunch meat. Turkey. Some shredded lettuce. Some avocados. Tomatoes. Huh? Yes, I do. The Mexican four cheese style blend, nacho cheese, oh, we need a dishwasher pot, Take those. some cinnamon sugar butter for my bagel, taco pack, what I have two of them, maybe not. some scoop, Doritos, and the other taco seasoning pack. Crock pot liners because I'm going to be cooking my meat in a crock pot. That's some hot taco sauce. Avocado ranch. I just wanted to try that. Is this avocado ranch? Yeah, it is. What was that noise? Mm. Queso. Mild taco sauce, mayo, and I think we got, oh yeah, we got paper towels, Sorry for the background noise. He would go upstairs and start vacuuming. Well, he know I'm filming down here, but um, I'm about to pull all this stuff up and then I'll come back when I start cooking. Hey y'all, it's your girl Nash, and today is Thursday, September 1st, let's take a moment, because what does that mean? <laughs> it's your girl birthday month, okay, my birthday is on 9-18, so yeah, it's, it's the first day of my birthday month, so yeah, I'm definitely excited, I'm definitely feeling good, happy, all the above. And so, as y'all seen, I just got my hair pressed, silk pressed, 
And what else did y'all see at the beginning of this vlog? Oh yeah, we had a movie night with my family where we watched Nope and we watched Orphan, the new Orphan or whatever. And that was like me and my husband's third time watching Nope because we went, not only did we go see it in theaters, but we watched it on this movie app we got or whatever. But anyway, besides the point, I just wanted to get on here and talk to y'all, you know, chit chat, catch up on what's going on in my life right now and everything. So yeah, September 1st is my birthday month. Um, I just got my hair done, as y'all see. And that's what I wanted to talk to y'all about, the hair products that I've been using to grow and retain the length of my hair. Because I'll probably insert a picture or a little clip on where my hair was at last year or earlier this year. I think I think it was earlier this year. Was that earlier this year? What? No, that was last year. Yeah, so. I don't know why I'm looking at him like he's going to give me confirmation. <laughs> <laughs> ah, but anyway, so, yeah, I think it was where my hair was at last year. And it's definitely a big difference, y'all. Like, last time I got my ends trimmed, my hair was, like, up here, like, chin length. So, the fact that it's closer, it's closer, it's, like, more. But the fact that it's past my shoulders right now. Let me show y'all the back. The fact that it's grown this much, y'all, I've been using something. My little secret formula, my little secret ingredient. But no, I'm gonna tell y'all what it is. But before I tell y'all that, y'all gotta, gotta keep watching the video because I'm gonna tell y'all later in the video. But before we get to that, I'm gonna talk about um, my birthday. So I really don't have any plans yet. I don't know what I wanna do. I just know, of course, I don't wanna be, get cute or whatever and get all dolled up and everything. So I do have a wig which is upstairs right now. I can't even show y'all, but I'm going to be wearing this blonde wig and I'm going to try to install it myself. And so I'm going to be using this, um, this Evan brand that I'll be seeing everybody use. It's the Lace Blonde, Lace Bond Glue, Extreme Firm Hold. And then I got the uh, spray too to go with it. So I'm going to be doing that myself. Um, what else I got to do? It would taste good leftover. Okay. Cause I don't be liking leftover pieces sometimes. I don't be having that same, you know, effect. Don't have to trim the yeah, I'm not. No, I'm feeling that. I do have a lash appointment on the 15th, so I'm gonna definitely be getting my lashes done. I still need to get my feet done, my brows done. I'm probably gonna be doing my own nails, and maybe doing my own makeup. But I might get my makeup done too. We'll see how that goes. But. Y'all tell me why I ordered, tried to order some Nike Dunks yesterday or whatever, like the camo ones, and I got the wrong size. I don't know how, I have that a sneakers app, so I don't know how it changed my size, but it, it's going to order me a um, woman's ten and a half, and I need a woman's nine. So I called them today, and I was like, can I exchange it, right? So I'm over here trying to exchange it. It's not, the, she stocked, the car's not going through. I'm like, I don't know why the money's on there. Then she's like, okay, I'll cancel the other order. So we can exchange it and then they just she put me on hold and it hung up on me and they didn't even call me back so i'm like you know what? i'm gonna just let it be canceled and try to get you know i'm, I'm gonna try to get the olive green low dunks because them is the ones i really want but that just made me mad though because it's like really but i'm not gonna let that put a damper on my birthday month so i do have a perfume that i got my from Rebel Scents. I'm pretty sure y'all might have heard it. It came in this box that says a scented revolution and it says it says uh everything on the other side, but I'm not trying to show my address. But let me go ahead and open this so I can show y'all the scent that I got. I've been really trying to get more into like um perfumes and stuff. And I honestly have found some through trial and error that I like. So I would have to say one that I know I like, I actually ordered it from, um, what's that thing called? Dos Dossier. It's spelled D-O-S-S-I-E-R. A lot of people be getting their perfumes from there. It's like a dupe perfume place online. And so I got, I tried the Lancome B Eshed Bell 
which I think is like a French one. Y'all, that perfume smells so good. And it was the dupe. So it's like, I know the real one got to smell good. But I was getting compliments everywhere I went like about that Lancome. So I think I want to buy the real one of that. And then another scent that I really like. Ooh, y'all, look at the inside of this box, though. They do the most. This is cute. Hold up, y'all see any this looks like light pink in here? Let's try to focus that. That's cute. Let's say hello, gorgeous. The real deal, personalized and affordable. Okay. So, yeah, I know I want to get the real Lancome. Then it comes with this card. Cute little thank you card. The packaging is everything. I'm loving it, though. Um. Oh, this is cute. All right, y'all had to take a picture for my thumbnail. So, but I'm back. And this is what it looks like. So, the little flap that it comes with, you lift it up like this. You lift it up. And then your perfume is in there. And it's crazy because I only ordered one perfume. So, I thought this box was kind of big. But, y'all, when I tell y'all, I smelled somebody wearing this perfume. And I was like, like, I could not stop inhaling. Like, it smells so freaking good it's this ariana grande perfume y'all it's called cloud get this right now like when i tell y'all how I, one fragrance i think that they hyped up was good girl the uh carolina herrera whatever they hyped that up because i bought that in the uh roll on so i can test it out and i was not i haven't even worn it like i'm not feeling it Maybe it's just a more mature scent, but I'm just not feeling it. Or it just don't work good with my body chemistry. But, y'all, this Ariana Grande Cloud. When I tell you I'm a warm scent type of girl, but this this scent is, like, warm and fresh at the same time. Like, when I smelled it on someone, I described it. I was like, I was like, girl, you smell like candy and baby powder. Like, that's the only way that I could really describe it like it just smells so good it smells like candy marshmallow and baby powder but I was like I'm definitely gonna get this from myself to treat myself for my birthday and I got it off rebel scent and I think I got it for like 60 it was like 60 dollars for the um this is the 3.3.4 ounces yeah 3.4 ounces so that's the pretty that's a pretty big bottle for that price and y'all I love the box though ain't this cute it's too cute. Yes, I'm loving it. I don't even want to open it. So let me. But let's get into it. I'm gonna show y'all the what it looks like. But this is, this box is really cute, y'all. I love it. Okay, so it's telling you how to spray it and everything. You gotta take take it out of the cloud base that it comes in that's like the decoration you take it out when you want to spray it so it's showing you that Ooh, let's get to it oh it actually just came right out of it itself actually but let me go ahead and um here it is right here this is like the cloud base it's kind of it's so big it's like the big i really got the big bottle i really didn't want the big bottle y'all but this is honestly all that they had left because this is such a popular fragrance and i see why honestly because it's it gives what it's supposed to give like i love it i love it and i'm not even gonna spray it now because i have one some vanilla perfume and i don't want to mix it or waste a drop but y'all i love it it's so cute so cute but yeah if you're watching this video and you want don't know what to get me for my birthday give me some perfume y'all okay give me some perfume what's another perfume that i wanted to get i'm trying to think i know i wanted this ariana grande cloud oh and i also wanted another scent off of this site but i might end up getting it myself as well the little girl might be a little splurging on herself but it's um rebel scents has their own perfumes their own brand so I was thinking about getting some of them. There's this one called Hexed. And this one called, um, I don't know. I forget what the other one's called. But the one called Hexed, I heard it was smelled really good. But, yeah, I can't wait. 
to wear this. I'm gonna wear this scent on my birthday. So yeah, I'll be wearing cloud. I can't wait for y'all to see what I'm wearing for my birthday and everything when it all comes together. But yeah. And I'm of course I'm like I'm going to throw away the box even though I hate to do it. But I cannot do it. The hoarder in me wants to be like keep the box, but I'm gonna throw it away. But it's really cute. It comes in a really cute box, y'all. It's really cute. The presentation was everything. But I'm gonna get me a little perfume stand for my dresser and then I'm gonna, you know, get my little collection together. And again, I'm a warm scent type of girl. But this hit for me because it, I like fresh scents too. Um, like I really like Dolce & Gabbana light blue because it's a real fresh scent. But this is giving like baby powder and um, marshmallow. But let me see if we got the... Uh, what the um notes are on here i don't think it does yeah y'all it's not even it's not even saying what the notes are or anything like that in the scent so. anyway back to back to the girl talk so me and my husband were thinking about fasting today like not eating anything and just drinking water because our stomach's been acting up but i'm it's uh going on probably like two or three o'clock and i'm already ready to give up and be like i'm hungry let's go eat but i'm i'm not i'm trying not to so he's like if we do eat something it needs to be something healthy I don't want to, y'all. I don't want to, but I'm really, I'm really craving some tacos. Really bad, really, really bad. But yeah. So yeah, I think later on I'm gonna get on here and uh, show y'all my birthday wig that I got from the Evelyn Rose collection, which I also probably link her Instagram in the description box so you can get you a nice wig. And one thing I like about her wigs is they are on the pricier side, but she does have. Um, what is it sizzle so you can do the pay in for um yeah so i'm gonna come back later and i'm gonna show y'all the shampoo conditioner and the oil that i've been using to grow and retain my length retain the length of my hair when i got my hair uh silk pressed today she did trim my ends a little she just dusted them a little because you know last time i got my ends trimmed they about cut all my hair off so I'm like, give me a chance. I'm like, let me grow. I'm like, let me keep some of my length that I be growing. I be growing all this hair and y'all just want to cut it off. But another girl that did my silk press, she was really nice. And she did a really good job. This hair is bone straight. And, um, yeah. It's really, really, really silky. And she also does makeup as well, y'all. I'm going to have to tag her. I'm going to put her Instagram in the description box. Well, I'm just showing everybody out. We're going to spread the love. Support black business. And yeah, cause she did what she what needed to be done. Do y'all see? And one thing too about the products I've been using before I show y'all, they're not only do, do I feel like they grew my hair, even though my hair already grows, they feel like it helped definitely, but it thickened my hair. When she was blow drying my hair, y'all. My hair never be looking this thick when I be getting this straight and not to me anyway. Like, you know how you can tell the difference, you know, for your own self. To other people, it might not seem like it, but to me, I can tell my hair got thicker. And I'm loving it. <clears throat> but yeah, y'all, stay tuned. Stay tuned for the, for the, um for the products that I use and also stay tuned for the birthday vlog because I definitely probably would be doing one and just be doing some fun stuff this month because it's my month it's my birth month and yeah just because why not so I'll see y'all later when I come back with the products that will grow your hair thicken your hair and I honestly think it darkened my hair naturally because it's like an Indian type of product and you know their stuff some of their stuff says that it naturally darkens your hair because my hair used to be lighter than it's now it's like we're getting close to black almost but besides that's besides the point y'all i'm just rambling but yeah i'll see y'all later <laughs>